we go. Alright, welcome back to more Grand Valley Keeper. I don't have to do that much farming stuff. I just gotta plant my crops. But for now, I make berry juice. Make like four of them. And then after that, I go make myself some red jellies. Twelve of them, actually. No need to, like, harvest more jellies. I got still way too many of them in here. Really? Yeah. Also, too, I think I have enough, actually, to, um, to press berries. Can you sell them? 20? Well, what do you mean? Sell the jellies? Um, I'm not quite sure. I don't think you can. Yeah. I need five more berries. I need 25. I only got 20. But I did make some oil. So if ever I use the oil for something, not really much you could use the oil on. Like onion rings, that's one thing. Fish, uh, fish nuggets. Mm, that's it. Yeah. Oh well. It's Sunday though. I'm gonna go pray for some uh, prosperity papers. And then instantly go to the blacksmith, so that way then I can uh, take care of him. <laughs> Hopefully get that cauldron the next day. That would be nice. Yeah, it would be very helpful. So I guess we go pray to the almighties to have enough stuff. Alright, here we go. Another beautiful day. I'd like to say a few words about our beloved church, you know. It's, it's pretty great. Uh, let, let's not lie here. Yeah. And now we're gonna pray. We're praying. We're praying to you. Get that cauldron, guys. There you go. Put your hands up in the air. Sway them around a little bit. Boom, my lord. Alright. Now, donations are great, both in game and in real life. There you go. Faith, everything's good. Awesome. I'm probably just gonna get like three and a half silver again. Oh. Yeah, well, three silver and 76. Not bad. It's getting slowly increasing. Yeah, that's true. It's not bad. So, we are good here. Uh, no need to build anything. What am I thinking? Alright. Put the faith in here. And... I'll, I'll figure out the rest of this stuff a little later on. I'm instantly going to go see the blacksmith to give him this commerce. And if, hopefully, if that's enough, then I can actually finally continue on. Because, man, it, it's, it's taken, it's taken its time. And I really, really needed that commerce paper. Alrighty. Ooh, I should also probably pick up all these, uh, all these plants over here. Come on, can I not? There you go. Butterflies. Butterflies are good for fishing. Uh, no room left for that. That's a shame. Can I eat? No, I can't eat a butterfly. No, you know you never know in this game. Okay, you could eat like weeds and stuff. So, all right, trading time. Commerce paper. Trade. The vendor will unlock this tier of items tomorrow. Yes, that means then I could get this cauldron. That is fantastic. Hopefully. Ooh. <laughs> Well, you know, I'm, I'm not holding my breath there because I keep thinking, like, yeah, it's ready for something, and then it's not. I know. Come on, why can't I get that? Is it because of the stupid flower in the way? It was because of that stupid flower in the way. Alright, I now have enough berries, actually, to go make myself some uh, fermented berry juice. Nice. Can I go chop down this old tree? Yes, I can. There you go, guys. Make it look nicer here. I took care of that old, wicked-looking tree. 
Only good, prosperity, clean living trees. I'm probably blaspheming somewhere, I'm sorry. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. Yeah, well, I'm, well, I'm behind, really, let's be honest. Yeah, true. Alrighty. Sweet. I'm gonna just bring a log with me inside my house. I really just want to go ahead and craft up this pail of berry juice. Alright, I can't even pick it up because I still probably have... Yep. Salt berries. Okay. Now with that, there are two berry juice pails, so now I can start finally fermenting some berries. Going up a ladder through a loft with a log on my back, that's pretty strong. Not gonna yeah, lie. That's impressive. Yeah. Uh, here, and this as well. Probably should go fishing again sometime, but I just have no time. Alright, where's my peat? There's my peat. And pumpkins. There you go. There you go. Come on. Get everything else rolling. Yeah. Get these crops going. I'm gonna need them. More onions. There goes the bishop guy. Okay, more carrots. Definitely, definitely more carrots. There we go. Oh, it's already peat in here. Why can't I put more peat in here? That's weird. Still, I would love it if I could put hops in here, but evidently that's the big negativo. Alright, so. Anything else that I can do? No, no seeds I gotta dump up? Nope, okay, we're in a good spot. A good spot. Alright, Venus Day. There you go, let's make a couple steel ingots. Well, some stealing gets, I should say. And gonna go to sleep. Tomorrow we get to see if the blacksmith will actually give me a cauldron. That would be so nice. It would be. Go through the underpass. Fermented berry is almost done. I'm really hoping for this cauldron so I could go ahead and give it to the witch so that way then she could remember so that way then I could go get the acid. But the most important thing would be to get apple and berry seedlings so that way then I could have them on my farm so I could just go kill jellies behind my house and then kill them, extract the goo, make some berry juice, and then I can go ahead and make red jellies. So that way then food is plentiful. Alright, trading time. Yes, he has the cauldron. Oh, and this is where I guess I could pick up uh, an axe or something. Y you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna pick up a cauldron, and I'm also gonna pick up this iron axe. There you go. So, dang it, I don't have enough room. Gotta cancel the offer real quick. Hold on. Um, oh, well, I'm at it then. There you go. Trade. Now cauldron. Now axe. Now I'm poor. But hopefully it's for a good cause. Because I got a brand new axe. And with that brand new axe, I could possibly go ahead and give it to the guy to learn a pasta recipe. Ah. That's what I'm going for. Where is this guy? Not up here. That's Tress. Where's the guy that was uh, sawing logs? He's somewhere up here. He's got like a tent or something. There he is. Here you go, I have a nicer axe for you. There you go. I'll give you two recipes, pasta and lasagna. That'll be all you need to keep cutting trees all day. Vegetarian? Meat is expensive. The trick is, uh, in slow-releasing carbs, lentils have even better protein. 
Okay. Yeah, this guy, he, he's turning into a meat eater and he's not really liking it. Or not a, not a meat eater, but he's turning into a vegetarian. Alright, but hey. I can create pasta and lasagna. And it has hard worker. You spend less energy working with axes and pickaxes. Craft in an oven. Okay, that'll be interesting to see. Well, while I'm at it too, let's go ahead and use my teleporter stone and go straight to my house. So that way then I can now go faster over to the witch. I got plenty of carrots still. There's no bodies waiting for me. I can now go see the witch. Things are things are looking better. They look good. Yeah. Alright. And now we can also go this way the fast way because I built the bridge. Behold, a bridge that has been built. And poof, there's the witch. Here's the witch's hut. God, that is so easy. This time? Yeah. Alright, I have a cauldron. Yay. Good, now I need those ingredients. Oh shit, I have black powder and a bee. Damn it, hold on right there. Damn it. I, I made life powder by accident. This is so great. Okay. I just need to get them and come back in time. But I'm a pretty much slow guy. So this might not be enough time. Please be enough time. I don't care if the doggy shows up. Come on. Give me the life powder. Life powder. Life powder. I'm gonna just bring two just to be on the safe side. Oh, I'll see all these white flowers. Now, I'm a bee. Oh, hi, berries. Alright, bear, uh, bee it should be in here. I'll bring two just to be on the safe side. Okay, and I'll put the butterflies away. Come on. Come on. I'm not gonna make it. I feel it. In my bones. Why doesn't it you make it? It's daylight. Yeah, but it's just about to turn dusk. Just a... There's the donkey, too. Oh. Come on, witch. Don't you dare walk away from me. Don't you dare walk away from me. We will get there. We will make it in time. We are almost there. Here we go, 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 here we go. Please don't move, please don't move, please don't move, please don't. There you are, there you are. Don't you dare move, don't you dare start moving. Yes, here's a bee. Here's the powder. Good, now let's see how it works. Hmm, let's check if it's ready. Oh, good. Oh, now I remember. I'm Clotho. I made too much. Here's an extra potion for you. Okay, now I'm back, so what do you need from old Clotho? She gave me health potions. Cool! I got some good stuff, you know. You won't find potions this good anywhere these days. Um, I thought I had to give her a health potion, but oh, fine. Uh, well, I need your help. Um, oh, but fine. Trading! What, what does she have? She has acid and a golden apple and electric powder and tree and bushberry seedlings okay. oh boy everything is unlocked from her too wow this is this is pretty awesome oh she also has frogs what did you do with frogs i don't know although i, I see the acid but i can't purchase the acid because i don't have enough money Really? Yeah. That expensive. Well, it's five silver and I got like two silver and 19 copper. I wasted way too much money. Wow. She wasted a lot. Um, just a lot of stuff, really. Oh. There you go. Equip of the axe. Yeah. Although, hey, I got it. I'm going to grab this log. I, I set out to do the task that I wanted, so that's the most important thing. 
And now, whenever it comes to seeing her, she she's there every single day, I think. Rosa, your actress. Yeah. Yeah, so... So she could help me out whenever. Whenever I have enough silver, I can then go buy the acid and then go ahead and give it to the archaeologist. Because I gave him the restoration tools, I just need now acid for the book. So we're in a good spot. Now the only thing left is to go take care of this body. Yeah, it hasn't been staying here that long too, so that's pretty good. Alright. Ooh, this one's this one's got some problems. Okay, so what is that? There we go. Oh, that was pretty easy. I took a bunch of white and I took a bunch of red, so hey, that's fantastic. There you go. Body's good. I'm prob I'm I'm not quite sure if having a ton of white skulls on them. We'll make it so that way then it makes the makes here even better, but who knows? All I know is the body is good. Minus two for that, plus two for that, so it all balances out. And there's a deed. And yeah, we're we're good. Here, I'll even put fermented berries right here. And uh health potions. Oh so, yeah. I got sweet, sweet health potions. Pretty good day. Went to church, got the cauldron, helped out the witch, buried a body. Yeah, we also planted all my crops again, so we're in a very good spot. Awesome. And I get to go to bed at a reasonable time. My god, it's a great day. Always wish for better, but as far as what I have, it's it's not it's not too bad. I still need to figure out how to like make acid and other things. But as far as everything else goes, pretty good. So yeah, I guess now I just gotta end it here. So hey, thanks so much for anyone watching. Hopefully you guys are enjoying. Have a good one and see you later. I am too. Hey there, thank you so much for watching Graveyard Keeper. Hopefully you liked it. And if you really like it, follow Jerry's example there and give it a thumbs up. I've also got plenty of other videos if you want to check them out as well. Feel free to do so. Have a good day and see you later.